Hi everyone, today we're going to be making rolls and these will be used to put our jam on that we're going to make. And if you haven't watched the YouTube video of the giant jam sandwich, you should watch that first before you do this activity because this goes along with the story. So let me see if I can adjust my camera here so you can see what I'm doing. So first, um, we're gonna put in a package of active dry yeast, Let's put that in there. And then next, one teaspoon of granulated sugar right here. Okay, and then we're going to add one and a half cups of warm water. Okay, and we're just gonna let this sit um, for 10 minutes or so. See if you can get a good look at that. All right, and it's gonna be foamy the next time you look at it. And um, full disclosure, parents, if you're gonna make this recipe at home, it takes a long time because there's a lot of rising, but these rolls taste delicious. You will not be disappointed. Okay, that was 10 minutes. So let's take a look at what the uh, yeast and water looks like now. See, it's kind of foamy. Okay, now we're gonna mix in the rest of the ingredients and then let it rise for two hours. So we need a tablespoon of salt. And that sounds like a lot, but these are really yummy. Good salty bread. And then we need a teaspoon of vegetable oil. Here we go. Teaspoon right here. Okay. And we need bread flour. Okay, we need three and a half to four cups. Okay, I'm gonna mix it all together. If I run out of time, then I will do a second video because I want you to see how we have to let it rise. All right, so there's one cup. Almost. There we go, one, and you gotta stir it as you go. All right, we'll see. No, you guys can't see that, there we go. All right, not quite a dough yet. See, this is another science experiment. We're going from a liquid to a solid. Okay, now that's all out. So luckily I had the uh, insight to get another bag of bread flour. Now, even though we're making this to go along with the giant jam sandwich, so we'll be making strawberry jam later to go with it. Sometimes just plain butter is delicious on these rolls as well. All right. So that's two cups, right? Stir, stir, stir. It's getting there. Not quite dough yet, but almost. We made these in the classroom last year and they were so good. And we made the strawberry jam too. Mm, it was delicious. Y'all are gonna love the strawberry jam with sugar. Mm -mm -mm. Now here's the third cup. It's getting kind of heavy there. All right. And it's okay if you go over a little bit. Try not to go over too much. So that's three cups right there. I guess you could always add a little water if you want, but try to not have to do that. So three, it looks like three cups might do it this time. So now I have washed my hands before beginning this. So now I'm just gonna get in here and really knead the dough. This is when the kids are gonna really have a good time with this. You just get your hands in there. Feels really good. All right, it looks like I'm probably gonna run out of time but I'll do another video so you can see how we set it up for um, 